Well, I came to baking late, and when I wrote my, well, it's, I wrote How to Be a Domestic Goddess, and I think it came out in 2000, which was my, uh, my, uh, you know, I, want, I had discovered baking and wanted the world to do so as well, and luckily, gratifyingly to me, they did. Um, I, now that I have become used to it and I bake a lot, it feels creative as, as well as scientific. I mean, I think that baking is a combination of chemistry and poetry. So you can't just be a chemist. You need, uh, you need to have some feel for taste as well. Otherwise, but, you know, um, so for me, and also I can't do the very intricate stuff. Um, I wouldn't do terribly well on the Great British Bake Off, LA, which I love. Uh, but nevertheless, you know, I think that they feed into one another. I think I'm at my most relaxed often cooking I, and not thinking about it and just, I love that. But you have to have an element of freedom when you bake as well. Not at first, but once you've got used to you know, you can't just say, oh, I think I'll put one egg in, not two. But you certainly can say, I think I'm going to do cinnamon and not vanilla or, or play with different ways of different icing. So I think that you can always be creative.